number one, make sure that your grandchildren have something to eat. If I thought my one of my boys were a little too thin, I used to bring them lots of cake. And then took them shopping. Number two, we have a tradition. We pick up the phone on their birthday, and this is how it sounded. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear. Happy birthday to you and many more. Number three, when it comes to your grandsons or your granddaughters, you will allow them to do whatever they want because you want to make them happy. You don't want them to be sad. And you tell them, okay, but don't tell mommy that I let you do it. That's right. We tell them to keep quiet. Whatever we got to do, we do it. Okay, number four, as a grandparent, don't be afraid of computers. Uh, I, I sit there and I enjoy getting... Yeah, there. you're right. Every time I look for her, I can't find her. She's always at the computer. She says, don't do the dishes. I'll do them. And she doesn't go in and stays at the computer and I have to do the dishes at night. <laughs> That's not true. Pardon me, it's not true. Number five, never, never, never pick a favorite. That's right. Make you, sure you treat them all the same. You can talk on the side between the both of us. We can talk which one is better, but we don't allow the other person to know that we favor this one or we favor that one. Well, actually, nobody is better than the other one. You know, they're all, all the same to us. So, so we got to see that we treat everybody the same, or they should think we do it either. And we do think anyway. We don't think about anybody being bad. Kenny and I have had the most wonderful blessing from our grandchildren, and I want to thank God for Am that. I Gotta, you know, yeah, I got to put our daughter, two daughters in that, that's been given well, us but that. but this is about grandchildren. Well, all right. But they're the ones that she's on. They're the ones that gave us our grandchildren.